What's up, YouTube? Dylan here with Dylan's Home Espresso Bar, and today, Barista Brittany is going to be sharing some Barista. high quality information to all of you guys at home. That's so you're, right. You're going to want to stay tuned because it's something you're not going to want to miss, I promise. Right? Right. But we're not going to let you know what it is until after we roll the intro. Bar, and today I'm just gonna let Brittany go ahead and discuss what we are gonna be doing. Brittany, why don't you just take it away? Barista Brittany. Well, today we're going to be making, well, he's going to be making me a spiced chai latte, but with a twist. With a twist. So, Bar Barista Brittany. What is that twist that we are talking about? Well, it's gonna be a spiced chai latte with espresso. So you're saying it's a dirty chai latte. Mm. Dirty chai latte. Correct. Get your mind out of the gutters, people, because That's dirty the name. is the espresso that goes into the chai part of the latte. And did you know? that spiced chai tea lattes are well known in Australia. Ooh, Australia. But, oh, but did you know no, that they were originated <laughs> in India? Are they? Yeah. So they're originated in India, but become widely popular in Australia. Australia. Yeah. Well, there you go. So, for all of you guys who live in Australia, thank you guys for making chai tea lattes popular. popular. And thank you, India, for making these drinks because my wife loves them. Yes. All right, so let's go make the latte. Let's get to it, folks. Yeah. All right. <laughs> let's get go. To it. <laughs> So we just finished pulling this beautiful shot. There was a little bit of channeling there, not too much. I mean, we hit perfect amount of time uh, along with the ratio one to two. We hit about 37 grams out in about 24 seconds. So I would say that's extremely good. 
we are going to be putting this shot of espresso into our not neutral cups. If you haven't checked these out, definitely go check them out. I'm not sponsored by them. They are absolutely amazing cups and it just makes you feel like everything's possible and it makes everything taste so much better in these cups. Hey, did you know something else? What? The spice chai tea latte, mm -hmm. they used to be for minor ailments and they didn't have black tea in it until the 1930s. Well, there you have it. I did not know that. I'm extremely happy now I know that do. now. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so since we don't want this shot to be sitting out, we are going to pour this into the cup and we're gonna go ahead and froth our milk. And we are also gonna be mixing the most important part, the chai. The chai. Chai. <laughs> All right, let's get to finishing the recipe. Right, so we just finished up making our dirty chai tea latte and we got pretty good latte art here. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and show you guys and up close. Not bad. And you get to have a nice view of her sweatpants. Definitely all coffee. I'm going to go ahead and give it an initial. Actually, this was th this video is all her idea. So I'm going to go ahead and give you the first taste test to let everybody know how good a dirty chai latte is. I've never tried them before. So, so. without further ado, let's see uh, how great or how bad dirty chai latte go. Sounds good. Is it? Yeah. That's all right, guys. I know COVID is going on, but we are married. I don't like chai, but <laughs> other than that, uh, I think it could be very good. So I honestly cannot give you a great opinion on this because chai is not something that I enjoy. However, she loves it. What would you give it out of 10? Mm, I'd say seven out of 10. And what would you do to change the recipe for all of you guys watching? Maybe just make it a tad bit sweeter. That's just because okay, so sweeter. she wants it a little bit sweeter. So some things that we could do to make it sweeter the is, is really we good. could add some chocolate powder. You could also add <laughs> some caramel and anything that you would want around the house, Hershey syrup. Uh, just pretty much anything. Uh, I would definitely try to get your shot dialed in, even though I think the milk and the chai is going to kind of cover that up. Uh, so how I made the chai tea latte is first, 
I extracted the shot from the bottomless porta filter. I dumped that double shot of espresso into our not neutral cups. I then took milk halfway from the bottom of the spout into the bottom of the jug. And then I poured the chai in through the rest of the halfway up to the spout. Froth that up just like you would normally froth any kind of milk when you're going to pour a latte, cappuccino, anything like that. And then you're just gonna go ahead and dump it in there and it's just gonna come out beautifully and you can make some beautiful latte art with a dirty chai latte. Now, you could do all these steps to make the dirty chai latte or, so you can just take half milk and then half chai and you can just froth that up and then you can have your drink right there by adding some cocoa powder or however you wanna make it to sweeten it up and then you just have a chai latte. So a dirty chai latte is just adding simply two shots of espresso or one shot of espresso, just anything coffee. So. If you guys enjoyed this video, please go ahead and like and subscribe to our channel. It really helps us out. And if you guys could share the word of our channel so that we can impact a lot more people around the world, we would greatly appreciate it. We enjoy making videos each and every day for each one of you guys because you guys have been absolutely awesome. I just hit 400 subscribers and I truly, truly appreciate it. Thank and you. we couldn't be more blessed. So. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And until next time, Dylan with Dylan's Home Espresso Bar. Peace. <laughs> Bye.